with you in Rockland. I would imitate the shade of my mother. Ooh. Hello YouTube, it's Balamore here, back again with more Blind Gaming and a new LP for the channel. Hooray! This one's called I'll See You in Rockland. For the PC of course, I'll put a link below in the description. As usual, you guys can check it out for yourselves, it is free to play. Even though the title says Howl, it's actually a poem this game is based off of. I didn't research what Howl was, but uh, that's what this game is. Is all about apparently so but it is called I'll see you in Rockland I'll put um, definitely put a link for you guys cuz I got a little confused myself unless for some reason they had to change it to Howl so if you're new to the channel I am blind I have no center vision at all just my peripheral so like I usually say if I can do this you most certainly can do it as well without further ado though let's do this God Solomon I'm with you in Rockland, but you're madder than I am. I'm with you in Rockland, where you must feel very strange. Okay, we are in it. This is another game, it's not super optimized, but plays pretty good. I see it has a little... Hello? Oh, you want me to look, do you? All right. Um. Okay, then. Oh, it's a big booze bottle? Is that a booze bottle? Something you see in the like prohibition. What the? Oh god! I actually got a little spooked because my headphones are cranked. What's this? Oh, you gotta like drag your mouse. So does that mean the <laughs> the door shut? Is that me and the guy that was just rapping his poem to me? Hmm. Oh, you gotta do it, like, forcefully. Okay. Uh oh. Oh, that's locked. Okay. I don't know. It looks, looks pretty good, actually. That door was a lot easier to open. There's nothing in there. Shut. There you go. Oh, I guess this was a dead end room. What the hell was that? I like the atmosphere. I know I've seen this kind of um, asset in a horror game before, but what the hell just opened? God, it's locked. Oh yeah! All right, all right. Best minds of my generation destroyed by madness, starving hysterical naked, dragging themselves through the negro streets at dawn, looking for an angry face. Angel headed hipsters burning for the ancient heavenly connection to the starry, 
dynamo in the machinery of night. Is that me talking? I'm not quite sure. I like the sound effects and everything. I'm glad there's voice acting because I don't have to worry about reading it. That would be a syringe. Okay, wait. Is there a key or something? Just a syringe. All right, on to the next. There we go. This looks different. Come on, pick it up. Pick it up. Oh, this is weird. The last furnished room emptied down to the last piece of mortal furniture. That's pretty weird. Yeah, this is a weird game. I might actually look up what um, Howl, the poem Howl was. Maybe we should check over here. Here we go. Okay, I read this quickly. It looks like a recipe for potato salad. I don't know if they he poisoned the potato salad, but that's all it seemed to be. Music's pretty good. So how you guys been playing something spooky? I hope so. I know a lot of my viewers actually, that's all they like. I think if I play something not spooky, it throws them off. It throws them off for sure. Alright, anything in here? God, these are slow to open. With you in Rockland. I will imitate the shade of my mother. Ooh. I like it. Oh yeah. Alright, what's gonna happen? You know, I played a game a very long time ago called um Something of Fear. What the heck was that game called? It was so good. It was really scary, that kinda reminded me of it. He was a painter, he was a mad serial killer. He killed his wife. There we go. It won't unlock this door, it was weird. Up or down? I say up. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I just played a game where it was like up or down, but um, I could I could just leap off the steps. So I went up. It turned out not to be right, and then I just jumped off the steps. Very spooky game. Hello? Oh, this is something. Is 
Is this a time thing? Maybe not. Okay, so this wants me to open them in an order. We should start with the third row on the left, and we're going to go down one. I'm going to try to leave that picture. I took a picture of this just to make it a little easier. All right, so it was this one. Okay. And then this one. I'm looking at the uh, photo that I took. All right, then it was this one. And then it was this one. Blocks. Oh, here we go. All right, we got a clock. What's the clock going to do? That wasn't a t too bad of a puzzle. Now, the reason I picked the left is because that was the only one in the circle that had one line. Oh wow. Um, I think I'm not supposed to be back there. What sphinx of cement and aluminum bashed open their skulls and ate up their brains and imagination? Yeah, I wonder if that really oh. is me. Solitude, filth, ugliness, ash cans and unobtainable dollars. Children screaming under the stairways, boys sobbing in armies, old men weeping in the parks. Yeah, this is weird. I like it. Moloch, the incomprehensible prison. Moloch, the crossbone soul its jailhouse and congress of sorrows. Moloch, whose buildings are judgment. Moloch, the vast stone of war. Moloch, the stunned governments. It's, you know what that guy sounds like? He sounds like one of those people that speak at one of those radical rallies that are anti-government. <laughs> that's what the guy sounds like. I know he's just being passionate reading the poem, but that's what it reminds me of. Look at this. Moloch whose eyes are a thousand blind windows. Moloch whose skyscrapers stand in long streets like endless Jehovah's. Moloch whose factories dream and croak in the fog. Moloch whose smokestacks and Atenius crowns the cities. Okay, that was actually demonic. Who's this Malak person or entity? Did he say, like, multiple Jehovah's? <laughs> That's kind of bad, religion-wise. Alright, I'm assuming they want me to jump. Why? Why would I do it? Just do it, bro! Or, I'm sorry, just do it, bruh! <laughs> My son plays Fortnite, and all you hear from him is bruh. They don't even say bro. Bro is bad enough. Just say the word. These ubonic enunciation, whatever you want to call it. Bruh. I don't even think it's bruh, I think it's bleh. Or bruh. <laughs> it's so funny. Alright, let's kill ourselves. 
Real holy laughter in the river. <laughs> they saw it all. The wild eyes, the holy yells. They paid farewell. They jumped off the roof to Sidon, waving, carrying flowers down to the river, into the street. All right, guys. So that was I'll See You in Rockland. I thought it was a good game. I thought it was interesting. I want to know what the poem was about, like what the whole thing was, but I think the game said what the poem was, but I really honestly I wasn't listening. All I heard was like multiple Jehovah's, Moloch, that kind of stuff. So I'm like, oh, it's demonic great this was technically an indie horror game even though there's no real threat which is nice from time to time have a little peace because uh i play a lot of games where there's threats a lot of unfair threats so it's nice to have uh, a couple games this one and the one i did actually recorded prior that was called i don't know what order i'm gonna do it in but um i think it was i opened the walls and found something beautiful that was the same thing it had no actual threat it was just an experience yeah not too bad I liked it. Let me know what you guys thought in the comments below. Like, comment, subscribe, share, and or donate. Until next time, as always, later.